Hello, my name is Dmitry and this is my new video. Let's add a little light to the room and in the tattoo more color. Let's go! So, friends, what will be discussed today? Speech today will go about the color tattoo. Most recently I've been tattooing Kerp in Japanese style. As I did it, then I beat, you can look in this video. Today it's time to color the tattoo. Before we began to paint the tattoo, we had to wait about a month. Human skin is restored in about 28 days. We decided to decorate it, but before that do not. Because the skin does not heal completely, you will damage it, the color will fade and the quality of the tattoo will be low. This should not be done. If it turned out that you overdid it, scratched somebody's skin, because we all on all of us make mistakes, then it's better to wait two or three months for the skin to fully recover. It should not shine and it should be smooth. With this tattoo we waited for the skin to heal for a month and now we decided to decorate it. Let's see how we did it. Let's go. Initially we made the drawing with Kerb. We already had a base, a sketch of Kerb, but we needed to fill two colored Kerb. What we did? Like I said, we found a drawing of a Kerb. In the paint.net program I displayed a Kerb image in mirror image. It turned out two Kerbs. I reduced the size of one Kerb and placed them next to each other. It turned out a composition of two different Kerbs, different in size and color. I painted I painted one carp in blue and the other in red. In my work I also used a shadow background. It turned out this picture. As time went by, we found out that we needed blue and red carp for a tattoo. For this I picked up the colors we needed. Here I will show you an example on colored pencils. For red carp I picked up such colors. I chose the most uh, approximate colors to red, from the darkest color to the lightest color. For blue care, I used this color range and added another white color. We needed to use several colors from dark to light shade. It was impossible to take in the work only a dark and light tone of color and to do a tattoo. I picked up the passing tones between them, two tones of color dark and red, and make them the right gradients of smooth transition will not work. And if it does, the tattoo will have the wrong effect. Therefore, as assistants or other colors that will make a smooth transition. The entire tattoo was decorated with the 15th round in magnum needle. It was convenient for me to work with this needle. Uh, the areas of this tattoo allowed to decorate it with the 15th magnum needle. The bigger the tattoo, the easier it is to use large needles. A large area of the tattoo should not be painted with a small needle. It will take a huge amount of time. There are no clear rules and restrictions work with those needles which you are more comfortable. There are many questions about how I paint a tattoo. People ask them because they do not know how to properly decorate a tattoo. For example, whether it is worth dyeing a tattoo tied to the counter or to go beyond it or leave a small area not painted over. People have doubts about painting a tattoo. Let's see how I do it. Perhaps for you this information will be useful. There is a nuance about how to properly color a tattoo, how to properly change needles or water or paints. Beginning tattoo artists first do not understand how to work properly. There is such an idea that between each color you need to change the cap or needles or tattoo machines. People are confused and I decided to tell you everything. When you paint a picture with watercolors, you have a glass with water and brush and paints. By painting the pattern in different colors, you wash the brush in the water so that it is clean before applying any color. Adhere to this principle when working with a colored tattoo. 
We take the tattoo machine, put its nose into a glass with water, press the pedal, the needle works uh, and the spout rinses. When I take out the tip of the tattoo machine from under the glass, I wipe it with a napkin or paper towel and dunk my nose in some kind of paint. The nose is clean and the paint is clean, it doesn't mix with anything. It is best to thoroughly wash and wipe the tip of the machine's tattoo before applying bright colors such as yellow and white. If you first painted the tattoo in a dark color, for example dark red, and now start to paint it in yellow, then of course wash the tattoo machine's pot well from the dark paint. It is not necessary to change the needles, tattoo machines, spouts of machines every time before a certain color. Adhere to the principle as an artist rinses a brush in a glass with water and you wash the tip of the tattoo machine. So we prepared a leg to paint the tattoo, washed and shaved it, determined a comfortable position. Everything is ready and we are ready for work. The work is long and long, so it is worth to arrange the most comfortable conditions, both for the master and for the client. This will not lose quality of work. I began to feel the tattoo in the direction from the bottom to the top to make it less dirty and better done. I began to score tattoo with cold blue colors. I always do that. When working with grey wash inks, I first fill in dark colors and then light to not tarnish the tattoo color and see the picture more clearly so that the picture becomes more contrast. It is convenient for me to work in such a principle. I painted a tattoo with the 15th round liner magnum needle, as I said. I made the circular motions. When I feel the tattoo, I paint a little of the outline. If you try to paint the area of the tattoo to the outline, a gap arises between the color part and the counter. If I paint the outline a little, then after the healing of the skin the counter will still remain black, because the black color is stronger than the rest of the colors and the outline will be uh, highlighted clearly. I did a tattoo with Vavilov's rotary tattoo machine, a link to the tattoo machine and models you can see in the description under the video. I expose the module so that the needles in it are hidden by half a millimeter or one millimeter, depending on the skin of the person. On the leg, the skin is dense and stretched, tattooing of this part of the body is comfortable. I paint the tattoo on the shadows because I knew that I would decorate the tattoo. If you put a dark blue or a dark red color on the shadow, then it will be darker than usual. The client has decided on the colors and this is the palette that has turned out. People ask how far to drive the needle into the skin. When you write with the pen, you do not press it hard. So it is with the needle. It is necessary to paint a small area with a needle, strongly not pressing it. If this is not enough, then you can press the needle to the skin more, but without fanaticism not to injure the skin.
At first I worked with a linear tattoo machine and then took a rotary tattoo machine. This was done for the sake of experiment. It was interesting to try to work with different tattoo machines and determine the difference between them. As practice shows, the linear tattoo machine is lighter than a rotary since the liner has a lightweight frame and this is a new model. As we see, the ichor is practically not allocated. Paints are densely laid on the skin, since the skin is dense. It's good to make both a contour and a color on the leg. If you look closely, you can see that the skin has not recovered completely. I gently paint the tattoo, I paint the counter. In my case, it was enough to wait for the recovery of the skin for a month. I did the tattoo carefully and neatly. So luck was on our side. While the work is in full swing, I would like to dwell on a certain point and tell you the following nuance. We are now making a gradient that is moving from a dark blue cloud a color to a light blue color. For the transition to be smooth and soft, we used additional colors. I want to show you on paper, as I do, to show the technique of drawing. Here is the breadboard model. Here is the curb scales. Almost beautiful. I first take the darkest color. I paint in circular motions and spray. Then I take the shade lighter, paint again and spray. Then I take the shade lighter, then the previous, I paint and spray. To make it more clear to you, I'll draw it like this. I apply a dark color in circular motions and gently spray. I take the color lighter and apply it the same way. Делаю дальше, 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 дальше. Беру. I take the color even lighter. Now I take a white color. Захожу тоже. It turned out such a transition of color, from the darkest color to the lightest color. You must put the color on the color. Before the color ends, I reduce the pressure on the skin, I take a new color, I adjust it on that side where the old color ends. It turns out that such color streak. I will do the same with the red color, so that you understand everything. The most important thing is to choose the right palette. Do not use a lot of shades of red. Tattoo is made in the style of Japan, many shades of the same color for it is not required. Here are the matching colors. Берем самый темный и начинаем его подстругивать. Бывает и такое. Стругачка, спасибо. Делаем круговыми движениями. I make circular moments, then reduce the pressure. Давление потом меньше, 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 меньше. И в ноль. I take the color lighter than the previous. 
I repeat the same moments. I again take the color lighter than the previous one. Давление мягче, меньше на коже. Берем мы еще светлее. Вот. От этого момента вкрашиваем круговыми движениями, вкрашиваем, вкрашиваем. You can finish the painting with one color and immediately start painting the tattoo with another color. But this is a different style, different technique. Now I take a color that is close to orange. I take this color and then I change it to a brighter color. I change the bright yellow color to white. It turned out so smooth and soft transition. In fact, there is nothing complicated in this technique. Take the colors and put them on top of each other. We color the tattoo tightly. When the color changes, we lower the pressure of the needle on the skin. Do not overdo it with tattooing. If you strongly paint over the tattoo, the ink will disappear along with the wound. If lightly paint, the color will wither and become dull. Потрется, сотрется, провалится, цвет тусклый вообще станет. Нужно золотую середину найти, и тогда и цвет будет яркий, и будет быстро заживать, и будет все всех радовать. Посмотрим, Let's see what we got. Как бы the colors are simple, but they look pretty. Such actions can be performed on any color. Оранжевые, зеленые, сиреневые, что придет в голову. When working with bright colors, you need to combine other colors correctly, so that one color underlines another color. Who studied at art school, he knows about it. I did not study anywhere, I achieved this on an intuitive level. To highlight a bright color, you need to give it a background, that is, determine the contrast, you need to select colors that will emphasize each other. Here is an example. On a black background, the bright light color looks even brighter and lighter. To achieve this result, you should either visit the art school or learn uh, by yourself through a variety of samples. There are questions about the color of the tattoo being smeared. It happens that the colors during the transitions are smeared. This happens when you strongly drive a needle into the skin. With the healing of the skin, the defect can disappear, but this does not always happen. With one hand I paint a tattoo, with the other hand I wipe off excess paint. With that hand that lies on the skin, I feel the vibration that the tattoo gives to the machine when it strikes. The stronger the needle enters the skin, the more powerful you will feel the vibration. By vibration you can determine how far you need to drive a needle into the skin. Вибрация получается, она тух-тух-тух-тух-тух-тух, именно 
ну как бы раз два три попробовал уже примерно рука practice more often and you can avoid many mistakes Практика – это дело самое лучшее, самое из всех. Самое большее только она поможет, и ошибки тоже вам будут помогать всегда, потому что без ошибок учиться невозможно. I first paint the first curb with a dark color, then light. Светлому, как я уже говорил, и... Lastly, I will paint the curb white. I always put on the skin white color last in order to keep its brightness on the tattoo. Немножко испачкать. Мне хочется всегда, чтобы белый был самый яркий, самый белый и самый самый. So I'm starting to paint the second curb. Дабы сохранить его яркость, его белость. I start with a dark color. I paint a lot of the outline. И просто от самой линии, на которую я захожу немножко, ну уже оно машинально у меня получается, мне не нужно прицеливаться, стараться, а вдруг залезу, а вдруг вылезу, как-то оно... If the side is narrow, I try to drive the paint into it with broken strokes. It is more correct, of course, to make circular motions with the right pressure. After painting some colors, such as yellow, green, white, do not immediately become bright. It is worth to wait about 10 or 15 minutes after the end of the process and the color on the skin itself will become bright. I paint curb in the same way as I showed you an example on paper. To begin with, you can practice on artificial skin. Do not immediately make a color tattoo on the skin of a person. Yura is a fine fellow, Yura became my friend. He attracted his wife and friends to tattoos. Yura has long been my client. I was making a cover-up to Yura's friend. They are good people, loving tattoos. So I paint the tattoo in orange. All colors fall on the skin well. 
On this part of the body the skin doesn't practically stretch, but I still pull it up a little. If the tattoo is on the elbow, armpit, abdomen, it is difficult to paint over. After all, the skin on these sides is thick and soft. In work it is always worth considering that on different parts of the body there is a different skin density. There are areas on the skin where the tattoo can be painted easily and quickly and there are areas where it is very difficult to get the paint into the skin. On the skin, close to the bones, it is necessary to carefully make a tattoo its contour and color. If you paint the tattoo on your leg quickly and easily, then you will not be able to quickly paint the same tattoo on your stomach. Покрасить, как вот нога сейчас, то живот для вас будет уже проблематичный, уже тот же самый рисунок займет. The work время. will take Больше more time, сил, effort and preparation. So I painted the curb and left small spaces for the shading in yellow. When I applied the pattern to the skin during the first session, I knew that the tattoo was going to be colored. So, according to the plan, I feel the contour and the shadows. On the shadows, the red color looks dark. When shading with different colors, I leave small spaces for the next color to look brighter. Do not make a color tattoo without thinking through the pattern, the transition of colors, your work. For more convenient painting of small parts of the tattoo, you can use the needles, the 7th round shader, the 9th round shader, the 5th magnum, the 7th magnum. I was comfortable working with the 15th magnum needle. Here was the 15th magnum needle. Uh, the diameter of the needle is 0 and 30 hundredths. It puts small dots. There is a water around the curb, but we didn't paint the color of the water because it was considered that the tattoo is full of colors. Here I am painting a flower. Now you will see how it will turn red. Уже кожа как, как бы вокруг воспаленная, и это уже в конце, уже больно все, уже все мучительно происходит. И кожа сама собой тоже живая, реагирует. Now there will be a little bit of an ichor, in general you will see everything yourself. Look what colors are used in this tattoo. The colors of course could be different, but we picked and chose the ones that the client liked. That's what I told you. An ichor. The ichor appears and uh, when applied to the skin of white color or other bright colors. Often wipe the skin when applying color so that the ichor doesn't get into the tip of the tattoo machine and does not spoil the other colors. Желтый будет разбавляться, плохо вкрашиваться, лишний раз травмироваться и будет каша. 
Если вы украшиваете белый цвет или желтый цвет, там какой-то салатовый яркий, то нужно делать так. First, a thin layer of Vaseline ointment is applied to the skin area. Then we apply a color and often wipe this part. So I wipe the whole tattoo. The color can be observed for another 15-20 minutes after the seance is over. The the skin on the body where I just made it to is still warm. It is necessary to wait that it has cooled down, uh, that after the procedure it is wrapped and that uh, the correct process of healing has gone. These are my works. So I finished work on the tattoo, the process was successful, you visited me not for the first time, and not for the first time he was pleased. Thank you for your trust and patience, Yura. What a summary we will sum up with today's video. The main thing is to choose the right colors and shades for the transitions, to decide on the pattern and choose the place for the tattoo. Correctly distribute the work, break it into several sessions. In this tattoo I made the outline using dynamic black ink, the shadow was made with the gray wash inks. After healing I painted a tattoo. With good working healing takes about a month, you can wait a month and a half and two if the skin has been damaged. So I remind you how I did the transitions of colors. Do not forget that bright colors next to dark colors will emphasize each other and look harmonious. On the internet there are many topics, tables, diagrams, video lessons on this theme. I did not learn to draw anywhere, no one taught me, no one showed me anything. I practiced the skill in practice by trial and error. Do not forget to often smear and often wipe the tattoo during the process. As a practice has shown, white color is the most sensitive and after it on the skin appears the ichor. Therefore, often wipe the ichor and do not let it get into the spout of the needle. When working with different colors, do not constantly change the needle in the machine, try to wash it well in a glass with water and continue to work. That's all. I told you and showed my work how I paint the tattoo, how I do it. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Learn and develop. Do not forget to subscribe to the group for beginners tattoo artists. Share your knowledge, support each other. Good luck!
I want to thank you for the messages, for the kind words you are addressing me. I am very glad that I can help you with something. I make my own contribution to the tattoo, I am showing you everything I am studying with you. Thank you all for viewing. Dmitry was with you. Subscribe to the channel, press the like the video, it will be more interesting later.